side of that coin is with Chamber of Commerce weather here. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah we went from hurricane force gust earlier in the week in the high country to nothing. And we like it. Take a look at a live shot down toward the Stockton waterfront. It's a beautiful afternoon heading toward an early evening and the temperatures reflect that it is very much like October should be. 76 currently in Sacramento as well as Stockton, 76 Modesto, 75 for Marysville. The humidity is at 18 percent, but the dew points are almost to 30 degrees, so they're going up. Earlier in the week, we had single digit humidities and dew points when we had the elevated fire concerns. Calm winds and a steady barometer. Right now, Zeta packing winds at about 100 miles per hour with stronger gusts. It's a category two storm is on shore already moving north northeast at 25 miles per hour. That's the good news. So it won't dump a lot of rain because it's moving so quickly, but it does have some pretty decent winds. By the time we get into the early morning hours, Tomorrow, it's already a tropical storm, and by the time we get into the early morning hours on Friday, it's pushing off past Cape Cod and out toward the Canadian Maritime. So it's going to move quickly. So that's the saving grace on this storm. Uh, again, other than that, it's still a hurricane, and we still have a, another month or so to go of hurricane season for the Atlantic Basin. Okay, storm track is pushing up into western Canada. It's going to stay up there. We will see something try to push the high pressure down a little bit as we get toward the end of the work week, but it won't influence our weather too much. So the cold batch of air that helped to create the winds and everything, it's gone. So tomorrow, look for daytime highs between about 75 and 80 degrees, so very similar to today. Not a lot of wind, sunshine everywhere, looking good. Then as we head toward the end of the work week, the last Friday of October, it looks like we'll have a chance for still the high pressure to be on top of us. This is not going to really influence our weather too much, so it looks like we'll be 75 to about 80 degrees. And then as we head toward the last day of October, which of course is Halloween, Weather's looking good. Then we're warming things up for the beginning of November. Upper 70s, low 80s tomorrow for the northern San Joaquin Valley. Thursday is looking great. 78 for Sacramento. Morning low at 46 with light winds. For the gold country, you'll have downsloping winds tonight. We'll turn them back around out of the southwest at about 5 to 10. So feeling pretty comfortable there. Look for 70s across the board. 72 for Pollock Pine, 77 for Auburn. Vern, our weather watcher in Pollock Pine, says the colors are starting to change there. Okay, mid-20s to get started in Quincy, but the afternoon is nice at 75. It's cold enough to make some snow up at some of the resorts. Teens and 20s for lows. Daytime highs almost to 70 degrees at Truckee and South Lake Tahoe. And then over toward the west, it's just nice. I mean, look at that. 73 for Monterey. 78 for San Jose. Great weather over toward the Bay Area. San Francisco might have a cloud or two to start, then a nice sea breeze in 72. Kind of warm 83 for Fairfield. Seven-day forecast shows you Halloween's looking pretty good, and the temperatures will start out in the mid-70s, and by the time trick-or-treating or whatever's done, like about 9 o'clock, should be down to about 60 degrees. And then, there you go, beginning of November, we're talking low 80s on Sunday, and we'll keep that for a couple days. There's your seven-day forecast for the Bay Area, all the way to the Sierra. Super comfortable temperatures. Again, in the foothills might see some lower 80s to start out the month of November as well. Elizabeth?